Police say George Johnson was the man at the center of a lengthy standoff with police negotiators Sunday inside a Burger King in southwest Baltimore City. Everyone fortunately was unharmed, of course tra uh, traumatized by this incident. Police say Johnson, with a gun, held four people hostage, two restaurant employees, a customer, and Keisha McCall's seven-year-old daughter. It's been like hell. My nerves was all over, all over the police. McCall's daughter had been with a relative who works at the Burger King when police say Johnson burst into the restaurant around 11 a.m. Sunday. This was after investigators say he was pursued by officers and then crashed into another car. There was a sexual assault that had been reported a couple of days prior and charges were filed against George Johnson for sexual assault. Officers recognized him driving a vehicle. They initiated a traffic stop because he had an active warrant for that sexual assault. The patience of police paid off. By late afternoon, some hostages started to be released, and by 5 p.m., the situation ended peacefully with Johnson in custody. This concluded with the help of a number of friends and family who assisted our negotiators with providing him information, but the negotiators were able to talk to him. I mean, he was very um, um, upset, and, and, and I think it appears that he might even realize the gravity of the mistakes that he made that led him to this point. And in addition to that sexual assault charge, police charged Johnson with handgun violations, taking hostages, reckless endangerment, and auto theft. They say the car that he crashed was taken without permission from a relative. We're live in southwest Baltimore. George Lettuce, WBAL-TV 11 News.